Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to RBN Web Solutions, a professional web design anti development company. In this video, we are going to learn how to replace or change any static text by CSS very easily. We are building this website for a construction company, but our client wanted to change the text to office timing to office hours. But in the dashboard, they don't have any option to sense this text that means it's not dynamic it's totally static text so we are going to see how to sense the text by css very easily uh, if you if your theme option has custom css then can you go to custom uh, css from uh, your theme option uh, if you don't have any custom css uh, option then you can uh, install a plugin for custom CSS and the CSS. Uh, sorry, JS. Then we are going to click on custom CSS to edit. We have a lot of code already. Then we are going to bottom and here we are doing code. First, we need to check the tag or class office time. Uh, let's inspect it. Then it's uh, on time class, so click on the class, uh, call it CSS, and here we need to make visibility hidden. So visibility hidden. Uh, we can do it uh, after and uh, before after we can do it uh, by before and after what we are doing uh, with uh, up after so time after we have to make it visibility uh, visibility visible then uh, we need to do position absolute after that we can keep content uh, here will be the text which one you want to put we want to put here office timing instead of office timing office hours so office hours uh, then uh, to style uh, the uh, to install the text we can uh, give here a color color to f2 to f2 then font size font size 16 pixel is okay i think uh, then padding bottom we can keep two pixel uh, hope uh, it will work then click on update then refresh the website yeah we can see here successfully changed office timing to office hours which one we have given there in content office hours and we can see here office hours and then we have to do a little bit more CSS uh, to bring this here. So we can give here margin left 19 pixel. And then update it again. After updating, I'll refresh the website. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, it will be not more than left 19 pixel it will be minus 19 pixel then refresh it again and uh, it's uh, not perfect yet oh, sorry then we can make it 100 pixels I think then update again and refresh the website 
and it's uh, I think fit uh, totally okay. So in this way you can change or replace any static text by CSS. Uh, hope this video will uh, help you. Uh, please subscribe to our channel to get this type of amazing tutorial in future. Thank you. Stay with RBN Web Solutions.